a great day is a day lived under the law of divine love. I decree for you that there is no criticism or condemnation in your world or in you, for you or against you. You are under the divine love law. And that is the order of your life this day. All is well with you and all is well with your world. You are under the law of divine love. Now let me repeat. Today, there is no criticism or condemnation in you, for you, or against you. You are under the law of divine love and all is well with you and in your world. You make that as a prayer. You say that, you believe that, you go out and experience that. If you think about those words, you see that they contain both a denial and an affirmation. There is no criticism or condemnation in me, for me, or against me. We can make such a denial because of the truth that we are under the law of divine love. God's love in our heart keeps us loving and it keeps us forgiving. Love restores harmony. Love promotes peace. Love finds expression through us in words that harmonize, in acts that are kindly and helpful. We are under the law of divine love, so we are free from undue sensitivity. We're able to get along with those who differ in our outlook or viewpoint, and love gives us a common bond a oneness of spirit that pours oil on troubled relationships. I decree today for you that you are under the law of divine love and all is well with you and all is well in your world. I pray that you live this prayer. I pray that you keep it in mind and you feel the blessing of it and that you live under what it says in Romans 12, verse 18. If possible, so far as it depends on you, live peacefully with all. I bless your day, my friend, and I bless it because you are under the law of divine love.